Hey YouTube, today I'm making a interesting video and it's going to be about Super Polymer Jason and why this card should probably be unbanned at 2 and well, kind of also uh, some quintily, uh put Elder Entity Norton at 1. I know that kind of hurts some decks but it also kind of balances the game a little bit and it makes people have to do a little bit more with their super power with their instant fusions than just playing Norton. So, with what I kind of have on the side deck here is a list of fusions that would be the most relevant if Super Polymer Zayson came back. So, with that, obviously, let's look into that. Um, now, I'm going granted and remind you guys is. With this list is I want you to imagine it with Norton at 1 versus where the ad is at 3 right now because at 3 it would not work. So obviously the Sadals were able to benefit but they are going to get limited. Also the Heroes. Now if the Heroes get Super Poly, this also uh, makes it so they cannot play Max Heroes as much. So interesting. Um, Odd Eyes. If Odd Eyes it would be... Definitely interesting for the pendulum matchup. Now, obviously, Panzer Dragon. Now, here is these are some other ones. I can't say most of them are really relevant. They're more like gimmick decks or interesting side or decks that people don't play that often. But they are worth noting. Um, I think I forgot the Phoenix, but everyone knows the Bombard Phoenix and. The Bombard Phoenix is always relevant, but obviously, so Super Polymer Jason, what it does is you discard a card to Fusion Summon. Now, a lot of times, you have to control one of those monsters because your opponent isn't going to control both pieces of the requirement. They're probably only going to control one requirement. So, with Super Polymer Jason, you essentially have to give up three cards and you're taking one of your opponent cards. That's kind of a iffy cost because you only get one monster out of it. Which means you essentially go neg two every time you play Super Polymer Jason. Reason why a lot of people dislike Super Polymer Jason is because you can't really negate it. Like, um, cards people like to use to negate it are obviously the Solomon cards, Magic Jammer. Well, nobody plays Magic Jammer, but. You get the idea when I bring up Magic Jammer um, and Psalm cards. Is people want to play Psalm cards to negate Super Poly. If they cannot, then this actually susceptibly weaken the Psalm cards by having Super Polymerization back in the game and forcing people to play like Battle Traps. Now, notice so hits, but most of these guys that I'm showing are the generic don't have effects that are super um, game changing except for obviously Odd Eyes Vortex but Odd Eyes Vortex isn't that hard to deal with and hadn't been that hard also here are some cards that deal with the fusion once you come out like obviously you can return it back blow it up battle traps um, bottomless or torrential there's some other cards like that, and I can't think what they are because they're not as close to relevant, but they're kind of so important to mention is all the trap hole cards do it. So now it's the dolls. Now it's Super Poly. I think the dolls to get the hit where they've been needing to get the hit on. And that would kind of be the most relevant and powerful Sadals in the main deck is Falco and Dragon. Dragon been popping all the important cards. Falco just lets you recover your fusions, which been kind of a st stupid abusable mechanic is because you can recover your fusion with your Falco, which probably should not have happened, but it got included with the deck. Now with Super Polymer Zayson, and like I said with Norton, I if you put Norton at 1 and Super Polymer Jason at 2, this essentially make Instant Fusion weaken because you tell me who's going to play 2 Instant 
uh, two or three instant fusions, and two super polymerization to summon the one Norden, and have four cards in your deck that are going to be dead when Norden is in the graveyard. Pretty much no one, because even though that's one power play, um, I mean, maybe somebody will. I don't know. I guess they could do it because people have been doing it for, like, the Brilliant Fusion, but people only do the Brilliant Fusion because it's such a quick and easy first-turn combo. Other than that, I don't think people would have done it. Um, Sadal Fusion is another example. Is They have the card El Sadal Fusion, which essentially is doing the exact same thing as Super Poly, Except for you're not fusing your opponent monsters. So. What are we really accomplishing? If you give them super poly. You're just telling them. Hey you got a card now that you cannot recover. And it also costs you an extra discard. Now for the pendulum mechanic. With odd eyes fusion and super poly. Is. I don't think they're going to be playing. Two and two of each. I mean they could. I mean, for all sake and reason, people would prove me wrong just for the sake of proving me wrong. But if they're playing Odd Eye Fusion, they're probably not going to be playing Super Poly because Odd Eye Fusion gives them a recovery when they have no monsters and their Pendulum Scale destroyed. Super Poly, if you destroy their Pendulum Scale, they're not going to get their uh, Fusion play off. So it's essentially they bounce each other out. So, uh, let's see. I have one card I really want to mention here is Norton at one. And the last card that's to get on the list is Refusing to just be banned. And I know that is a weird hit, but this card is an abusable card with Norton. And it doesn't have a see any other play and still had not seen any other play other than with Norton. And I don't want Bulk Cube or Norton to get banned because Norton helps out some decks, but he should not be a free eater. And Instant Fusion, I mean Refusion just recovers it too much. So with that, this is my point and this is where I stand on why I think Super Polymerization should be at two. So you can tell me if you guys disagree or agree. Um, please list or state your comment and tell me what you think of the video why or you agree or why you disagree so have yourselves a great day see you guys again bye